Well, picket lines are down, signs put away for now. The Writers Guild of America says there is a tentative deal with the three Hollywood studios. This comes days after negotiations in 146 days on the picket line. CBS 2's Darius Johnson is live in the newsroom. And Darius, this could get production in Hollywood back underway. Hey there, Dana and Jim. Before that can happen, the contract must have a full vote, which is scheduled for tomorrow, Tuesday, and that could mark the end of the strike getting writers back to work. After four and a half months, a tentative deal was reached between Hollywood writers and major TV studios, ending the strike just days before it would have become the longest writer strike in history. This deal comes after five consecutive days at the bargaining table between the union and studio heads from Warner Brothers, Netflix, among others. Others. For writers, sticking points come down to the use of artificial intelligence, staffing, and residual pay. The details of the deal have yet to be released, but we do know it is a three year deal, and the Writers Guild of America calls it exceptional. This pretty much looks like the train has left the station and is on the tracks towards one of the Hollywood strikes being over and the next one now going to negotiations. So we could th see things moving pretty quickly towards Halloween. Now, on July 14th, about 65,000 SAG AFTRA actors joined the picket lines as well. Their demands are similar to the writers. As of now, there's no word on when those negotiations may end. We're live in the newsroom this morning. I'm Darius Johnson, CBS 2 News. Darius, thanks.